Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Neil Galvin. I'm a registered nurse and I do have a degree in medical surgical nursing. I create my nursing educational videos to help nursing students and nursing professionals like you with their studies. If that is something that you are interested in, please make sure to subscribe now, hit that notification bell so that you will be the very first to watch my newest uploads. Also, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and share with your friends because that will really help me know that you'd like to see more content like this. Without further ado, you guys, let's jump into the video. Hi, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Isang panibagong nursing lecture ang ale ko sa inyo for today. And this week is going to be amazing and full of knowledge regarding your nursing education. Now, before I further proceed with this video, I would just like to say hi to everyone who's listening and who's watching right now. I, I just... I'm just so happy, you guys. You know why? Because we are really moving so fast towards 20,000 subscribers. And you guys are amazing because you made it all happen. You are amazing. Thank you, thank you po. We're running towards 18,000 na nga. Nako, 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 nako. Maraming, maraming salamat po. Please make sure to keep on sharing, keep on liking the videos I created because it helps a lot the channel to grow to spread the news about this channel that certain channels regarding nursing education exist here on youtube you guys you can follow me in all my other social media accounts everything is at neil gave except for my tiktok account which is neil gave official i'm also going to be posting this video on my facebook page which is neil gave all the links to my videos to my social media accounts to the playlists and how are you going to reach out to me is all in the description box, check the one out. Ngayon, ito ay panibagong, <clears throat> excuse me, my throat. Ito ay bagong entry natin sa ating nursing theories um, playlist kung saan I give you a like a short, brief discussion about the nursing theories and their theorists. Now, like, you, like I said before, if you want me to go and do a thorough deep dive theories, a uh, deep dive discussion on each of the theories and their theories. I mean, to the core, like, hihimay-himayin natin yan. Tulungan nyo ako, sabihin nyo lang sa akin sa description box because that's what we're gonna do on the next, um, on the next upcoming videos. But on this particular one, I'm gonna provide you five theories and their theorists. Diba? Mahaliga kasi na malaman natin itong mga bagay na ito because these theorists, um, are those who made our nursing, uh, nursing profession and nursing uh, education as a body of knowledge. Dahil sa mga theories nila, yun yung nagbuo ng fundamentals of nursing, yung mga inaaral natin ngayon. Ngayon, kung hindi mo pa napapanood yung other nursing theories videos and other nursing educational videos I created on my channel, ah, pakarami na nga po. I believe I created like more than 500 videos uh, on this channel alone regarding nursing theories and nursing education, medical surgical, nursing test banking, laboratories, nursing skills and procedures, fundamentals of nursing, anatomy and physiology, um, cheat sheet. Nako, ang dami na nga po. Panoorin mo yun because that is all for you. And don't forget to tag me every time you share my videos um, on your social media platforms para naman makapagpasalamat ako at malaman ko kung sino ka, kung nasan ka, at ano yung mga ginagawa mo to help spread the news about my channel. Maraming maraming salamat po. I am so, so grateful. Ngayon, sisimulan natin to because this is going to be short and quick. Magsisimula na tayo, ha? Five nursing theories and their theorists. Okay? Let's begin. Simulan natin kay Betty Newman. Sino, to, sino ba to si Betty Newman? Ako, alam ko na marami sa inyo ang pamilyar kay Betty Newman. Okay. So, I tried to really come up with their images, their pictures online. Just so you have, you know, um, you know, a visual presentation of who they are. Kasi sa mga visual learners natin dyan, minsan hindi nagsisink in ako. Personally, hindi nagsisink in sa akin yung knowledge or yung information kapag wala akong visual presentation. I am very visual. So, this is all for you guys. Alright, so Betty Newman. Ano ba to si Betty Newman? 
Siya lang naman ang nagpakanakala ng human system model. She defined nursing as a unique profession in that is concerned with all of the variables affecting an individual's response to stress. Now, she focus, uh, the focus is on the client as a system, which may be an individual, family, group, or community, and on the client's response to what stressors. All right. All right. Now, the client system includes five variables. Ano ano yung five variables na included sa Newman system model? Ano yon? Physiological, psychological, so uh, social cultural, developmental and spiritual. Yun yung limang factors na included sa or variables na included sa an sa study ni ni Newman's. Now, it is a conceptualized as an inner core basic energy resources surrounded by concentric circles that include lines of resistance, a normal defense line, and a flexible line of defense. Once again, this is Betty Newman's brief description of her body of work, the Newman's system model. Now, if you want us to do a thorough deep dive, like, like I said, let me know in the comment section below. Magproceed na tayo. Sinong next? Si Sister Calista Roy. Familiar kayo kay Sister Calista Roy? Absolutely. Now, let me uh, introduce her to you. Now, she promoted or she um, initiated the adaptation model. Uh, Roy defined nursing as a healthcare profession that focuses on human life processes. And patterns and emphasizes the promotion of health for individuals, families, groups, and society as a whole. Di ba sa nursing, hindi lang naman tayo nagpa- nagpo-focus sa patient itself, sa individual person, the person who is sick. Di ba kasama na rin dun yung family, yung groups, yung friends, so society as a whole. So adaptation model, when you think about adaptation model, when you hear about adaptation model, the first person that will come to mind is Sister Calista Roy. Now views the individuals as a set of interrelated system that strives to maintain a balance between various stimuli. Inspired the development of many middle-range nursing theories and adaptation instruments. Once again, this is the body of work of our Sister Calista Roy. Adaptation model, Sister Calista Roy. Okay, next, we have Dorothea E. Johnson. Si Dorothea E. Johnson ang nagpanukala ng behavioral system model. Ano ba yung nilalaman ng behavioral system model makinig? Now, this defined nursing as an external regulatory force that acts to preserve the organization and integrate the patient's behaviors at an optimum level under those conditions in which the behavior constitutes a threat to the physical or social health or in which illness is found. When you think about behavioral system model, you think about Dorothea Johnson. Ito po yung picture ni ate mo Dorothea, eh, di ba? Mm. Babad sa Fundamentals of Nursing, naka-sunglasses, charing. Next, advocates to foster efficient and effective behavioral functioning in the patient to prevent illness and stresses, the importance of research-based knowledge about the effect of nursing care on patients. Kapag may nurse, yung behavioral system model, nilalaman nito ang Evidence-based practice, research-based practice, that is your Dorothea Johnson. She describes the person as a behavioral system with seven subsystems. Ano-ano yung seven na yun? Makinig. The achievement, attachment, affiliate, uh, affiliative, aggressive, protective, uh, protective, dependency, ingestive, eliminative, and sexual substances. When you think about behavioral system model, when you think about research-based knowledge, and when you think about um, the behavioral system with seven subsystems, that is the theory of Dorothea E. Johnson. Malino bayon? 
Napakalinaw ngayon. Bago tayo mag-proceed, last two theories na nga theorists and theory na nga theorists na nga tayo. Kung hindi ka pa nagsasubscribe, mag-subscribe ka na at ishare mo na ang video na ito. Para tuloy-tuloy ang paggawa ko ng mga nursing education na videos, you have to let me know that you guys are enjoying this and you find this one helpful. Sharing is caring para malaman na ng ibang tao na mayroong mga online class online nursing class sa YouTube. Okay? Let's proceed. We have your Anne Boykin. Ito si Anne Boykin, ha? Wait lang. Change ko lang. Ito si Anne Boykin. Ito naman si Savina O. Uh, so, oh my God. I probably butchered her name. Sowenhofer. <laughs> Ang hirap. So again, this is Anne Boykin and Savina O. Schoenhofer. Schoenhofer. Ano to? Ano yung, ano yung ano nila? Ano yung theory nila? Sila lang naman ang nagpanukala ng the theory of nursing as caring o yung a model of transforming practice. Ano ulit yon? The theory of nursing as caring a model of transform a model for transforming practice. Ano bang nilalaman nito? According sa kanila, nursing is an exquisitely interwoven unity of aspects of the discipline and profession of nursing. Nursing focuses and aim as a discipline of knowledge and a professional service are nurturing persons living to care and growing in caring. All right, so yun yung um, a brief description ng Model of Transforming Practice. Caring in nursing is an altruistic, active expression of love and is intentional and embodied recognition of value and connectedness. Connection, love. You think about Model of Transforming Practice, you think about Anne Boykin and Savina O. Schoenhofer. I'm sorry, Savina, if I butchered your name, probably... Probably, but I tried my best. Once again, this is Anne and Savina. All right, last ng last yuris nang atayo. Eto na siya si Afaf Ibrahim Meli. Oh, di ba? Afaf Ibrahim Meli. Si apa? Si Afaf ang nagpanukala ng transitions theory. Ayon kay Afaf, ang transition theory nilalaman nito, it began with observations of experiences faced as people deal with changes related to health, well-being, and the ability to care for themselves. Types of transitions include developmental, health and illness, situational, and organizational. Acknowledges the role of nurses as they help people go through health or illness and life transitions. Afaf also focuses on assisting nurses in facilitating patients, families, and communities' healthy transitions. When you think about transitions theory, transition from uh, family from patients to families and communities, healthy transitions, you think about Afaf Ibrahim Mali. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching. I hope you learned something today. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more nursing educational videos. You let me know if you have other nursing topics that you want us to do. Comment it down below. Abangan nyo nga po yung next upload natin this coming Wednesday because I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Three times a week na nga po tayo nag upload and it's going to be fun. Okay? Na tulungan nyo na nga ako ay pamalitan nyo na sa Radyong Sira ang pinakabago, pinaka-fresh at ang pinakalibring nursing review center sa balat ng YouTube. Follow me in all my other social media accounts. Everything is at Neil Gave except for my TikTok account which is Neil Gave Official. This video is also going to be available on my Facebook page. It's Neil Gave. I have a podcast channel. It's available in Anchor and Spotify. It is called 3 a.m. Conversation with Neil Galvin. Tomorrow, I'm going to upload a new episode. And I hope I can see you there and be with me there. It's 3 a.m. Conversation with Neil Galvin. Available in Spotify and, podcast and Anchor. I'll see you again on Wednesday. You have a good one.